Can you imagine to live in a space that is smaller than three square meters with other two people? Can you imagine to never go out from the same room? Can you imagine to be torturato every day? Can you imagine to have only one escape? The suicidio? You can't. But all these things happen every day to more than 6,000 people in prisons in Italia. It's true. You have to believe it. In a hot summer night, a Russian soldier arrived to my great-grandparents' house. My grandmother and her mom were sleeping outside in front of the house when they heard bootsteps. My grandmother woke up her mother and stated, Mama, vin rushi, mother, the Russians are coming. And then she said, don't worry, I know how the Russians are, not knowing that this time it was different. Unlike in the Great War, they were our enemies. In 1948, a tragic stain on the page of Romanian history, a page that brought with it 65 years of sufferance, loss, pain and grief for hundreds of thousands of Romanians. To date, Romania has lost over 400 property restitution cases at the European Charter on Human Rights. In my hometown in Bulgaria, there is an institution that deals with refugees. Most of them are from Asia. They are seeking for protection in the EU, but instead they are living in bad conditions and they cannot really fit in the community or integrate. They don't have even the most vital things like enough food, clothing or medicine. They cannot find work mainly because of the language barrier, therefore they have no chance for a better life. Instead, they're treated even worse than prisoners. <laughs>